we wake. Oh, hello! Welcome to my humble studio apartment in Los Angeles, California. Oh, the good times just begun. in from <laughs> basically this studio is not that big so I had to get a little storage space here and I just covered up with a bunch of pillows oh there's a tag so let me cover that up <laughs> but I got this on Facebook marketplace for 40 bucks and I also got the couch on Facebook marketplace as well this is my favorite couch ever because I wanted some luxurious looking leather couch and looking very classy. Facebook Marketplace is where it's at. I got this beautiful llama as well. It has this boho feel, which is what I try to do with my apartment in general, is create a classy feel, but also the boho chic vibe. And the blue mainly is actually to match my oven. <laughs> the teal blue color oven and the fact that I have really great natural light in this apartment is the reason why I jumped on this one right away as soon as i saw it i said yes this is it with that i also created that hole in the wall myself and as you may see there are two holes <laughs> it is an extra hole that's because i made a mistake it's a little bit levitating down but don't worry it's stable and these plants are very low maintenance you only have to water it once every one to two weeks it's still alive after a month and a half I wanted to make it a little bit Christmas-like, so put this right here. <laughs> this is a way for me to save on dining room space. So just having bar stools and then putting these placemats here. So this is where I eat my dinner, my breakfast, my lunch, and if I have a guest over, I can have up to one guest over <laughs> essentially. And you can see that I also have this little Christmas tree. <laughs> Side note, this Christmas tree I got at the Dollar Tree store, $8 total. This area is my office space, which is just my chair, my desk, which by the way, I got the chair and the desk for $20 on Facebook Marketplace. Not that I'm promoting Facebook Marketplace. This is my light that I typically use for my YouTube videos. I really wanted to hide all my Wi-Fi wires and all this crazy stuff. That's the main reason why the bench is right here. Again, Facebook Marketplace for 20 bucks. So over here, you can see that I did cover up my bed frame. And so when you walk in, you can't really tell that this is my bed. So it doesn't feel like, oh, I'm just walking into somebody's bedroom. When you come around here, you'll see my lovely bed. I did, I made it super comfy. And this was just a comfort set from Target. Target has everything. If it wasn't on Facebook Marketplace, I probably got it on Target. This pillow's from Target. All of this, pretty much Target. And the bed frame itself I got from Wayfair, which I don't recommend. So they sent the bed frame over, yet there were so many miss missing pieces. I contacted Wayfair, hey, can you send me the missing pieces? And they said, no problem, just donate what you have and we're just gonna send you a whole nother one. I thought, great, so I'll pretty much have two. Thank goodness I kept the other bed frame that had missing pieces because the second one they brought me had missing pieces too. So I had to take some pieces from the first delivery they gave me and then combine it with the second delivery and so all together, it was one whole bed frame, but there were missing pieces in both bed frames. So even though it seems like they have a deal, but you get what you pay for. I have my little side dresser, which again, $20 Facebook Marketplace. And I got this for free. It's supposed to be a eyeglass case, but I made it a jewelry case, which I think is perfect. And then here is my lovely closet. I like this little gold frame. Right, so this is my small walk-in closet. I tried to put most of my long stuff here and then my short stuff here. And then I have my steamer, my vacuum cleaner. You can see up top, this is where a lot of my et cetera storage is. Obviously my little suitcase, travel suitcase. I have my little bags up here and then what's really cool is that way up top 
they have this little shelving area which I put more stuff, <laughs> miscellaneous books and things like that up there. It's a closet slash storage space just because I don't have that much space in the studio, but it works. Oh, yes, my little hallway. This is my little hallway, this big. <laughs> what I like about this is one of my clients and she's best friends with Jason Mraz and I love Jason Mraz because I'm a fan. Here are my goals. If you follow me on Instagram, then you might have seen this or you recognize this. And if you don't, go ahead and follow me on Instagram because that is where I update you on just my personal stuff. When I walk out of my bathroom, I'm going to see this every freaking day and it's gonna remind me every freaking day, I gotta work on this, I gotta work on this. Reminder, Tina, keep doing this, keep doing this. And it's colorful and bright and happy and fun because I like to make my goals fun. If it's not fun, you probably won't do it. My bathroom's very simple. My lovely curtain I got from Target. This I got from World Market, very boho vibes. Blue Spa candles are everything. They sell it at Sephora or if you just go to Blue Spa. It not only smells amazing and it's very potent, but they also put it in these beautiful jars that are just so aesthetically pleasing. You just want to even keep the jar in itself. What I really wanted to make sure to do, I just wanted to make things look aesthetically as pleasing as possible. So covered brush covered toilet plunger and a covered trash can so with a lid on it i do take a bath nearly every day it's a tranquil spa-like experience and not the toilet is right there in front of my face i didn't want to feel like that i'm gonna open this really fast it's nothing exciting and we have these ugly bars here because it's supposed to be handicap friendly which is wonderful and amazing but one thing i like about my bathroom is that there's one palm tree. When I take a shower, I'm like, mm, there's one palm tree outside that makes me feel like, hey, I am living the life. <laughs> Powder room from Target. This is handy dandy because you can do all this. And then I try to put things in little areas. This is Dollar Tree Store, Dollar Tree, Dollar Tree Store. So again, Dollar Tree Store is great. Oh, this is originally, I got it for free. It was a vase, a flower vase. And then here are all my bath bomb salts just because we need them. And then even putting my floss thing in these little glass. Again, Dollar Tree Store, it just makes everything look a little bit pleasing. The kitchen is really great. It has five stove mechanism although i only use one stove at a time i mainly use my ninja which is a blender well this studio apartment i didn't know until i moved in but they don't pay for water and sewage and trash and actually that's a hundred dollars a month extra and most other apartments they'll say hey water trash included and i never thought anything about it because i was thinking okay great like that's probably not that much money anyway but turns out, it's a lot of money. This has been amazing and awesome, spectacular, just to have you come on in into my personal space. I'll link below just some of the products if you wanted to check it out. And I hope to see you soon. Please hit the like button, comment below what was your favorite, or if you have any advice for me as a new apartment holder, let me know, comment below, and subscribe. I will see you on the next video. Remember, raise your vibe.